Legacy 650 is a large business jet developed by Embraer. Following completion of its maiden flight in September 2009, the aircraft entered into service in late 2010. The aircraft received type certifications from the National Civil Aviation Agency Brazil and the European Aviation Safety Agency in October 2010. The ANAC also certified the Legacy 650 for high-altitude landing and takeoff operations in August 2012. Embraer reached a joint venture agreement with Aviation Industry Corporation of China in June 2012 for establishing a production line to build Legacy 650 aircraft in China. The joint venture, named Harbin Embraer Aircraft Industry, was expected to roll out the first aircraft from the production line by end of 2013. Embraer signed an agreement with Jet Aviation Moscow of Nukovo in May 2012 to provide service to the Russian Legacy 650 aircraft customers through Jet Aviation's maintenance and repair facility at Nukovo International Airport. The Legacy 650 aircraft is a longer-range version of the Legacy 600. Its range is 500 nautical miles higher than that of the Legacy 600. The 650 also provides higher altitude takeoff and climb thrust than the Legacy 600 aircraft. The aircraft has 38.5 in compound swept fan blades and features a new bypass vane and core vane. It has a length of 26.33 meters, height of 6.76 meters, and wingspan of 21.1 meters. In addition, the aircraft received type certification from the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration in February 2011. Cabin Space What distinguishes Legacy 650 private jet charter from its rivals is its cabin. The spacious Embraer Legacy 650 typically features 14 passenger seats and a three-seat divan spread across three cabin zones. Seats can be fully reclined to create four single beds and one double bed. There's also a fully equipped galley and a large lavatory. The cabin management system includes passenger controls at all seats, iPod, iPhone docking stations, Blu-ray players, radio, 3D maps, and wireless remote control. It has one of the nicest restrooms in its class, with three seating areas and a large galley. Even a sizable pressurized, climate-controlled baggage room is included. Embraer has made a significant investment in sound reduction to make the cabin even more pleasant. This includes locating the sources of noise and getting rid of them wherever possible, even the cockpit. The network system in the cabin is also available to passengers, and with the optional high-speed data through Swift Broadband, they may use it to send and receive emails and browse the internet just like they would on the ground. Engine and Performance The Legacy 650 is powered by AE307, a two turbofan engines manufactured by Rolls-Royce. The two engines generate about 9,020 lb of maximum thrust each. The engine emits about 22% less carbon dioxide. It also features full authority digital engine control system. The aircraft has a range of 3,900 nautical miles and a cruise speed of max 0.80. The service ceiling of the aircraft is 12,497 meters. The unfactored landing distance of the aircraft is 5,741 feet and the takeoff distance is 5,741 feet. The operating altitude is 41,000 feet. The takeoff weight of Legacy 650 is 53,572 lb, while its landing weight is 44,092 lb. The aircraft has a zero fuel weight of 36,155 lb. The enhanced range capabilities and performance features for which Legacy 650 is renowned are made possible by the 9,020 pounds of thrust each of the two Rolls-Royce AE307 and two engines can produce. Charter Legacy 650 from Embraer is unquestionably a great choice if you're seeking a contemporary medium-range business jet.